The Mahoney Center is a multi-service center, which means we do professional development for teachers, about 900 a year. We engage in school intervention research. We have developed and piloted curriculum for talented youth and children and have field tested it. And we do direct service programs for children. Well, the purpose of this center is to provide services to teachers and schools in general to deliver those direct services, to continually investigate what works for talented youth and children, and to advocate for the appropriate kinds of policies and procedures in schools and at the state levels that will help children and youth attain their best. The perspective is there's always more to do to help people reach the highest levels of which they're capable. We don't want children, we don't want adolescents, we don't want adults to be bored and disengaged. If they're not challenged, in other words, if there's not an optimal match between what a child knows now and what they need to learn next, then you don't get the opportunity for every child to learn something new every day. I think the challenge and also the exciting part of teaching advanced learners and gifted learners is you never know when they're going to bloom in the classroom. So an understanding of how students learn is absolutely critical for uh, providing appropriate learning opportunities and curriculum for the children. The Jody Mahoney Center works really hard to provide great learning opportunities all year. For example, during the summer, we have a summer laureate university for youth where students can experience a wide variety of courses from studying a zombie apocalypse to enchanted engineering tales. STEM Starters Plus is a program that operates from grades one through five, and it has two or three components. It has a curriculum component which includes an engineering unit, a science unit that's quite advanced, an accelerated science unit, and a biography about a STEM character, might be a, an inventor, might be an engineer, might be a scientist, but that tells a story about how one can be passionate and curious about a STEM subject across that curriculum. That's the school intervention. It's coupled with an understanding that professional development has to accompany any kind of innovation. And so we work with teachers, not only to understand STEM and how to do that in an elementary classroom where it's less likely to be occurring, but also how to spot talents among children in classrooms. In first grade, a lot of classroom teachers have a misconception about gifted and talented students and gifted and talented education. So the professional development exposure help open their eyes to what it means as a service for students in need rather than a club. And it helped open their eyes to the importance of their role as talent development, helping students to become creative learners, critical thinkers uh, from a very early age. The engagement piece, um, they've always loved science and being able to give them that opportunity to do more science, it reaches every learner. They love it. They are so excited when they see materials out and they know they're going to get to do something instead of just listen. And they all just want more and more hands-on and they do just learn so much. This is something that they don't, they've never, they never get it's an opportunity me. for and they just, they just go and, and explore and you really get to highlight those students you never expected to. This has been a conduit to assisting those regular classroom teachers in really understanding what those characteristics look like in a highly engaging atmosphere. The impact that the Jody Mahoney Center has had on the entire state of Arkansas mm -hmm. is amazing um, because although I'm in the Little Rock School District, I have not always been in the Little Rock School District and I have to say that I'm an alumni from this program, but the support that was provided to me through this uh, graduate program and the opportunities that that has afforded me have been phenomenal. It really helps us uh, have a group of people who have a common understanding about building the units for the gifted kids. So I, I kind of have a special appreciation for that because I've hired quite a few teachers that have come through the program.
The level of engagement from children is amazing. If we can capitalize on that kind of engagement, it translates into learning and it translates into achievement. It translates into creative thinking and innovative thinking. It, it translates into looking at the world as a place that has constraints, but one can meet those constraints and solve those problems. And I think that's vitally important when we're thinking about how to develop talents in children.